the, the question that we should ask ourselves is, what can we do to produce this similar type of response, even in very difficult conditions? And when we want to experiment and try this approach on new soils that don't have a history of cover crop applications, but where we need a strong fertilizer and nutrient response immediately in this coming year, um, what is it that we can do quickly that has very strong economic benefits? And so to, to replicate what a cover crop can do with root exudates in, in releasing these soil nutrients, years ago we developed a product called Rejuvenate that was uh, developed initially, the, the initial purpose for developing it was as a residue digester to uh, speed up residue decomposition for corn residue in particular. And we discovered to our surprise that Rejuvenate had a market effect on increasing nutrient availability. To such a degree, uh, we have a number of soil analysis of treated and untreated side-by-side -side, uh, field, split field applications where uh, available calcium levels would jump by, in extreme cases, as much as 40%. Uh, available phosphorus and potassium levels would jump by 20 to 30 percent. You might take a soil from um, 60 or 70 parts per million all the way up to 150 parts per million potassium. Um, so there's these tremendous increases in nutrient availability that showed up in soil as nutrients were extracted and were released from the soil mineral matrix. But the challenge with rejuvenate, as time has gone by, the, the uh, materials that go into it um, have inflated in cost, as has everything else. And Rejuvenate, 15 years ago, when we first developed it, was a very inexpensive material to apply. And today, it's no longer as inexpensive as it was. So, uh, Rejuvenate had a lot of horsepower in the, re in the context of releasing nutrients, so much so that uh, we had a group of growers in the New England states and in various areas where they had very challenging soils and, and uh, challenging fall conditions for establishing a cover crop. And their nickname for rejuvenate became a cover crop in a jug because they saw the same types of soil aggregation benefits, the same types of nutrient release benefits, the same types of benefits that they were getting from a cover crop, but just resulting from a single application to the soil.